In today's video of Can We Make Billions, a abandoned gas station came up for sale after 30 years of being out of business. Over the next three days, we're gonna be restoring this gas station and turn this pile of trash into cash. We're coming in, big cat. Boss man's already tearing it up in the excavator. It looks like we're light. We got the trusty Kubota 97-2, dirt bucket and pallet forks, then the old D5 cat bulldozer. For war sale by owner, we better rip this out. It ain't for sale no more. She's sold. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, we got to do it in style. Let me bring the excavator over. I'm ready. Just don't hit me. Here we go. I won't. Perfect. Nice. That disintegrated it. I hate to ask, and I don't want to know, but how much do I owe you for this place? Oh, yeah. Quite a bit. So it was 600000 total, which means 300000 each. There you go. But honestly, the land value alone is worth that and then some. So break it down. What do we get from buying this? Well, we have the rights to the land and that comes with the rights to build a gas station on here. Obviously, there was one here at some point. Uh, it's looking a little rough, but we're going to be able to revamp this thing. I'm honestly thinking just tear it all out. We'll keep the tanks underground and make this thing look good. I'm going to get the drone up in the air. I want to get some shots of this place before we turn her around. The story behind the gas station is 30 years ago, it went out of business and it was a booming station. Now this bridge used to be the only way to get across the river and so everybody drove by the gas station getting to and from work. From the bridge all the way down the highway it was bustling with traffic for decades and decades. And then they built the new bridge. For the past 30 years this new bridge has taken all the traffic, a couple of cases have popped up and the old gas station had to close down. And now with people moving closer to McGregor, we're seeing more and more demand for a gas station and traffic going down this road. Let's start stripping this topsoil, leveling out the base, get those fuel tanks uncovered. The inspectors will be here in about two hours. There's big old fuel tanks that are buried below there. They're 40 years old. So we got to show them to the inspectors. They'll verify that they're still in working condition and then we'll be good to go. Bossman found a glitch in the machine. Right now he's got it on, he's spinning. And then he turned it off randomly and it still kept spinning. Oh no, oh no, it's going faster this oh, time. Oh, this is, this is going really fast. Okay, okay, okay. Do I get out? You found a cheat, infinite energy spin. Uh, do you get out? Yeah, jump out. It would be cool. Watch out, watch yeah. out. Oh, you almost got hit. Yeah, it's still doing. Okay, uh, wait. Now how do we stop it? I just We're got a text. Inside. Inspectors are going to be here in watch one out, minute. Watch out, watch out. Oh, okay. Hurry up and this get in that thing. Idea. The inspectors are going to be okay, here in one okay, minute. Um, okay, here we go, here we go. Oh, that can't be good for the machine. This is a rental. That's good enough. I think you got it dug out. Let's kind of clean ourselves up a little bit before the inspectors get here. I don't have any of their clothes. Okay, what if you talk to them? I'll just hide. 10-4. Yep, pull on in, sir. Oh, ma'am, ma'am, go ahead, pull on in. We'll get you off the road there. Yeah, our driveway isn't made yet, so... Good thing you got a nice pickup. Nice to meet you. Follow me, follow me. I got the tank right here, dug up, cleaned off. She looks pretty good condition if I had to guess. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, I'm very good at running the excavator. All right, let's see what your report says. Oh, geez. At the bottom here, what's this $10,000 fine for? I just bought the place. Oh, you see a leak in the tank? Hey, that's not my fault, ma'am. Yes, I will get it taken care of. How much? To oh, only 24 hours to get it fixed. Dang it, I see the fine print now. All right, I will get this fixed. See you in 24 hours. Boss man, where are you at? Spencer, what's up? Oh, what's up? There you are. Jeez, you were really deep in the bushes. I didn't even see you there. Well, I was trying to hide. And I kind of got a thorn somewhere I didn't want it. Uh, anyways, I'm good. I'm good. I'll use the excavator to pick it out. I just don't have a thumb on it, no, so it might no, be a little I'm rough. Okay. Yeah, no, I'm okay. Okay, what, what Here's did the she paper. say? Uh, no. Does anyone from the city like us? I, I feel like this was targeted. A little bit. So we have to take out all of these bolts on the top fill right here, and then we got to put a new gasket in. She said it's leaking. Stairs are leaking. Man, then there's a few ridiculous. pinholes. ridiculous. Yeah, it's rough. So I am going to run a couple shutoff valves too. You keep working here. Do not close this till we have her done. I called ahead. They should have my order ready on stuff like this. I like to rush, rush, rush. And there's my boxes. They're so good at setting it outside for me, and it's already ready to go. Locked and loaded. One strap. Tailgate shut. Let's roll. Look at how tiny this car is compared to me. Let's see. Boss man, get out of the skid steer. I'm going to need a hand. Grab a couple of those boxes out of the bed of the truck. Can you grab me another battery? My impact wrench is dead. Okay. Here you go. Thanks. I'm going to zip these off. Hopefully they come off. They look a little rusty. Open that box right... No, the other box. Here you go. You do it yourself. Catch. I don't want to... Oh, just see, this is why we don't... We could lose these things, man. These aren't cheap. Guess how much all those four boxes cost? I don't know. Uh, five bucks? Five grand. Oh, that's a bit more than five bucks. 
Can you grab the pipe wrench in the back of my truck? Do you need anything else, or are you gonna keep making me run back and forth? I need some pipe thread and tape. There should be... It's like pipe ceiling. Here, catch! No, it's not in that. Oh, this one? Catch! Alright, yep. Got it. And we lost it again. Alright, it's good to go. All the leaks are fixed. Ball valves replaced. Leave the tank open. We have a bunch more work to do. Are we tearing anything else out? I'm thinking we tear out all these pumps and replace them. They're old. We got everything removed. Now we're going to smooth everything completely. Are we still planning on leaving that sign? I think we should leave it just for like nostalgia. Maybe they will upgrade it a little bit. You know, make it a little taller, add a few more displays. But, you know, the, the core structure will stay the same. Well, the ground is all slicked up and leveled out. We have the hole ready for inspection at 6 a.m. tomorrow morning. Boss, man, I'm heading out. All right, yeah, I'll be heading out too. This has been a long work day. The sun's starting to go down. It's time for some beauty sleep. I slept in a little too much this morning, and I'm running late. I'm going to have to go without Boss, man. He could drive himself. Sorry, ma'am, sorry. I am hopefully you weren't waiting for too long. I brought you an extra cup of coffee. Here you go, this is all I did. Ball valve is replaced. All the gaskets on the seals are in. Torqued down to the proper specs. We passed? Yes, thank you so much. There you go, thanks for the hug. Yeah, you have a good day too. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to, uh, okay. Hey, 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 did she already come? Yes, she signed off, she was here five minutes before I even got here. All right, I guess we'll cover this thing up and then let's get a gas station built. Push, push, push. Looking good. You're starting to get some dirt in there. There we go. We got the hole filled. We'll just grade it out a bit. That looks good, boss man. Now let's start installing the gas station. I'm thinking we make this thing way bigger than it originally was. Like, I want to get a weighing station here because obviously trucks go by all the time and like really get this thing looking good. Yeah, they're on their way to I-80. So that is, this is like kind of a detour spot. All right. Well, let's get to it. Let's start with the weigh station. Hey, look, we got some deer. I think I scared them away. Why do you always get distracted by deer? Like, I don't you know, know. Christmas is far away. I had some candy in my pocket, so maybe they were sniffing that. Yeah, that's definitely not what it was. This looks Anyways, good. Anyways, yeah, I'm happy with this. I think this will work out well. Most trucks should be able to fit in this, no problem. Perfect. One thing out of the way, on to the next. Is it time for the pumps? Time for the pumps or upgrade our sign here. I'm kind of curious how good we can make this. You plug it in yet? It's plugged in. I hope these solar panels will be enough for this thing. All right, come down. All we really did was add some Wait, height, new LED how lights. How do I get down? Uh, you, I'll catch you. Here we go. I got you. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I think it looks a lot better. Very similar to the old one. The lights work way better now. It's shiny. We cleaned it and new solar panels. So it's time for the pumps. Yes, sir. These are looking pretty good. We got the pumps roughed in. Yes, sir. Are we going to put a cover over this or should we just leave it out in the open? Yeah, let's get a canopy. It's looking good. We got the posting canopies up. Heck yeah. So, okay, we have gas vehicle covered. I guess yep. now it's time for electric. Let's kind of stay away from here. Let's expand a little more and have the charging stations maybe over here and then the convenience store on the other side. Yeah, let's do that. This is looking good, boss man. Nice work. Thank you. I appreciate the help. We didn't get electrocuted, so no complaints there. Yeah, I didn't help that much. I was on the phone most of the time talking to my buddy who owns a couple Starbucks and he wants to build one here. Where are we going to build it? Aren't we getting a convenience store? Yeah, you know, I was kind of thinking convenience store and I was talking with my buddy. Just do the Starbucks and then they'll have others, you know, a section for other snacks too. Oh, okay. So the Starbucks more or less instead of a convenience store. Yeah, exactly. The Starbucks is in. A drive through and everything. This place really has come together nicely. I love this. We really turned this place around. It looked like a piece of trash when we got here. It's going to be very cool to see how much money we can make off this place, how much people enjoy it. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Yee!